Hello dogs, Ignitex here, coming at you at extreme speed with episode 22 of Pokemon Uranium Nuzlocke. Last time we made it through Route 8, finished that place up, and now we'll be doing the alien themed side quest that I've been hyping up quite a bit before we challenge the gym. Now, you might be wondering, hey, this, this video went up at like, it's like, I don't know because I'm recording the video, obviously. I don't know when it's going to go up. But almost definitely not at night. So you'll you probably be like, why the heck is... What the heck is this? It's not night time yet. Well, no, it's not. But I changed the computer time because I just wasn't feeling up to waiting until, um... Say... 8 o'clock, that's when it starts, the game starts, considering it to be night. But anyway, yes, um, I think we're as prepared as we can be without doing over-the-top grinding. Let's put Bonnie up front and hope this goes well. I've forgotten quite a lot of stuff about this side quest, so... I don't really know what to expect anymore. I know I've said that this isn't a blind playthrough because I've played this game before. And I've done the side quest before, but... Okay, yeah. Things are working out as they should work out. Oh, you're a trainer, aren't you? Listen, are you interested in mysteries? Yeah, sure I am. I need some help, and I, I need a trainer to do it. Great! My name's Ripley. My grandfather owns all the fields you see around you. But he's travelling abroad and left me to manage the farm. Lately, though, we've been having strange phenomena. I fall asleep at night, and when I go out to check the fields in the morning, half my crops are bent over. Not only that, but seen from above, there are all sorts of weird shapes and patterns. I can't figure out it all. I think it might be aliens dun, 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 in the act, but I always fall asleep. I know there's something out there, but every time I catch sight of one, it zooms away before I can get a clear look. It's very frustrating. So that's where I need your help. I need you to sneak through the fields and find the source of the crop circles. I always see a bright light on the other side of the lake. So maybe that's where they're coming from. Be careful not to let them see you, though. Okay. So we have to avoid detection. Which I must say is damn hard. This music's different to normal. Damn it! I keep getting sent back to the beginning. How was I supposed to see that one? This is dumb. Move, please, the one I can't see. Damn it, I couldn't see that one! This is getting old fast. Darn it! What's the point? Oh, there it is. We got through the maze. Now, looks like it's their leader. It's gonna attack. That isn't friendly. That isn't friendly. I only... Level 40! Level 40! Oh my goodness! I don't remember it being that high level. Oh my goodness! Flame wheel! I outspeed a level 40?! Okay, that does nothing. Okay. Gyro ball, you're spamming gyro ball. Good, spam it, spam it. Yes, burn, burn it. Burn it, flame 
my god! Yeah, that was easy! That was a piece of cake! What was I worried about? Zoom! So that's what was causing it, huh? A Pokemon! But that doesn't explain my why it was attacking. It's easy, really. It's because I was bored. Is this your Pokemon? Who are you? <laughs> Lived here all your life, Ripley. Shouldn't you know me by now? Sheldon, I can't believe you're doing this again. <laughs> Isn't this obvious? This town sucks. Everyone's so content with their boring little lies. They don't know what real excitement is. If you have to stay holed up in that gym for much longer, I'll die. I don't think it's very funny. I should take it out on my granddad's farm. Well, it just goes to show how country people have no sense of humor. Now, I know you're a lousy trainer, so it can't be that you have defeated S51A. So then, who? Was it this kid? Ignitex. Ignitex? Hmm. You must be a strong trainer. S51A is my strongest Pokemon. I don't even use her to fight challenges in the gym. You're in the area, so I assume you must be here to challenge my gym, right? I'm looking forward to it. S51A, take us out of here. Okay, that was the alien side quest. So he hates, he hates the town. That is bad. And there's Pokemon all around the world, S51. I did manage to catch one, didn't I? Here they're pretty rare. If you didn't catch any, I managed to get one. But I'm not really much of a trainer, so would you like it? Yes, please. Heck yes. Nickname S51. What do you nickname it? Cause it's like a space robot kind of thing. Are oh, there numbers? Okay, yeah. I'm gonna call it because it looks like R2D2. I'm gonna call it R2D2. So yeah, obvious Star Wars reference there. Yeah, I am using a vent claw, so I I can get that Pokemon. So yes. I know we really... Something... Yeah, something. This is a something episode. We did a thing, and I think that's good enough to call it a day. Especially considering Bonnie in next episode is probably going to be pretty long. Actually, no, it's probably going to be really short because Bonnie has the gym in the bag. I'm pleased that we didn't get any deaths against that S51A. But anyway, yes. I know it's a short episode, but I think it's best to have one every once in a while. So, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to show your support by commenting, subscribing, and leaving a like. And with that being said, peace out, dudes.